Okay, good morning and welcome to today's Finance Committee meeting, the first of the 2018 to 21, 2021 session. My name is uh, Danny Drum and I'm the new chair of this committee. Bef <laughs> Thank you. Um, before we begin, I want to express how excited I am for the opportunity to chair the Finance Committee and express my appreciation to Speaker Johnson for entrusting me with the privilege of being able to serve in this role. And I also want to take this opportunity to thank the former chair, Jalissa Ferreras, <coughs> for the excellent job that she did when she uh, was in this role. I'm also looking forward to working with the Finance Division staff, led by the Council's amazing Finance Director, Latanya McKinney. And to my colleagues on the committee, uh, both those I have served with before and those new to the Council, I welcome all of you. As Finance Committee members, we have a unique opportunity to fight for the priorities of this Council and for the needs of communities across the five boroughs. I am confident that ours will be a fruitful partnership and that we will make meaningful differences in the lives of New Yorkers over the next four years. Turning to today's business, the Committee will be voting on two items. The first is a budget modification that implements changes to the fiscal 2018 adopted budget by transferring funds between the miscellaneous budget and the Council. Additional information on the modification can be found in the committee report distributed by the Finance Committee staff. The second item is a pre-considered introduction that would extend deadlines for several submissions and hearings concerning the fiscal 2019 preliminary budget. This includes the Mayor's submission of preliminary budget to no later than February 1, 18, the Mayor's submission of the preliminary management report to no later than February 15, 2018, the Department of Finance's estimate, estimate of assessed valuation of real property and certified statement of all real property taxes due and uncollected to no later than March 5, 2018, and the Council's hearing and submission of recommendations on the preliminary budget and the Mayor's preliminary management report to no later than April 10, 2018. The full list of changes can be found in the introduction and accompanying committee report. Unless there are any questions on the two items, I will ask Billy Martin, the committee clerk, to call the roll. Are there any questions? Sorry, one, no, yes. no, one quick question. Does this push back our um, budget hearings from, from March until, to, to April, or doesn't have any effect on that? No, no effect. Okay. No, that's all. Thank you. Okay. Billy Martin, committee right, clerk. Billy Martin. Roll call vote committee on finance. Items are coupled. Chair Drum. I vote aye. Cohen. Aye. Lanceman. Aye. Rosenthal. Aye. Gordenchik. Aye. Adams. Aye. Powers. Aye. Matteo. I see nothing has changed with my colleagues sitting on that side, with the Republican <laughs> leader on this side. I see how it's going to be. All right. Uh, I vote aye. Gibson. I think that's only because you chaired the Ethics Committee now. No, <laughs> nobody wants to get too close. By a vote of eight in the affirmative, zero in the negative, and no abstentions, both items have been adopted from the committee. Okay, we're going to hold the vote open for another 15 minutes or so for those uh, members who are still uh, expected to arrive but are late due to subway delays. Thank you. Continuation roll call, Committee on Finance, Council Member Gibson. I vote aye, and I want to congratulate our new Chair of Finance, Council Member Danny Drum. Looking forward to working with you and your leadership um, in this new season. Congratulations. I vote aye. 
Thank you. And the same here, as a matter of fact, uh, Councilmember Gibson, uh, in terms of your work on the subcommittee on uh, capital uh, budget. So look forward to working with you. Continuation roll call, Committee on Finance, Council Member Moya. Vote currently stands at 10 in the affirmative. 